trouble Mother Mary comes to me Speaking words of wisdom Let it be And in my hour of darkness Like such a unique mashup, man. Honestly, did you guys come up with that yourselves? Yeah. That was awesome, man. Honestly, for you guys to, to just flip from genre to like that, it was it was awesome, man. I didn't know that you had that that style to you because even though you were basically swapping between genres of, of music and all that, you were still putting your sound to it, which I personally love. You know, I love. Yeah. My only advice to you would be is to not put so much pressure on yourself because I know how much you want to succeed in this, man. I know how much you love this. And honestly, you've got nothing to worry about. You're an incredibly talented guy. You've got everything going for you. And that performance there proves it. Because I must say, I know there were times where when you did put pressure on yourself, your pitching would, would falter. And it would affect your vocal at times. I didn't see any of that there. That was spot, almost vocally spot on perfect, man. You should be really proud. You keep stepping it up. Good man. Amy, what do you think of Ethan's performance? I actually really enjoyed that. I love how you made such a well-known song, your own, and it as if it would never been done before. I found your pitching much better this week. Watching you grow from where you started and how you struggled with your pitch, and I found it much better this week. I found your breath, breath control much better. And I like how you use the stand. I like how you sort of move with the stand a little bit and like you own your stage presence. You still move around, but even though you've got the stand in front of you, it was a much better performance this week, and I really enjoyed it. Thank you. <laughs> Kelly, what did you think of Ethan's performance, Kelly? Yeah, it was really clever to mash like Bob Marley and the Beatles together, and I think that that's showing that you you like um, you're growing so much and seeing where you want to go and where you want to put your voice to, and it was a challenge and it paid off. Um, I I think that that really showed off your tone with the you know the strip back acoustic back in. We really got to hear your tone and there's like this husky rasp there and it was absolutely beautiful. And I I, I want to hear more of that kind of tone. So I think like acoustic things is where that you we're really going to get to hear you know that the beauty of your voice. You should be proud of that. Well okay. done. Um, I mean Ethan, um, you know first of all, well done for what you just done. It it. I want people to know that you, because your, your tone is so individual and so unique for a guy, um, like when we do rehearsals, it, it is quite difficult to find the right song that suits you because your, your tone is so spe specific, you know? Um, but it's a beautiful tone and it's a tone that's going to blossom and really, really have this current feel to it in the industry now, you know? And it is there and we can hear it behind. We, we are listening behind me like, it is... 
this uniqueness to it. Um, I love the fact that you've done this with this tonight. Um, and I want people to know that, like, you know, every week for you is learning a new, a new song from scratch. Because when you came here, you had no songs behind you. So you had no songs, you were a little bit thing. It was just the Callum Scott ones that we got to you at the start. So everything you've done since has been learning from scratch. I mean, you, oh, what's that? I don't know. But you're taking it on board and you're learning it from scratch. You're doing your own things with it. And, you know, there is still this thing, like I said, this was much better tonight. I found you put your, put less pressure, pressure on yourself when you was up there, like mindfully. But there is still that little bit more way to go to make sure everything's spot on your picture and everything. There is still room to go. But we will get there because you do have massive potential. And once we get to that point, it, you're just going to blow people away, you know. But I just want people to know that sometimes when, you know, when there's a unique tone to someone's voice, it's like a very, very special tone that needs a little bit more moulding to get it to exactly where it needs to be. And that's what you are. You have this really beautiful tone, but it is going to take that little bit extra to put it to get it to the right place to where it needs to be. But you nailed that. You've done something very, very intriguing and interesting tonight. And i got to applaud you for that too, because this was very unexpected for you. So well done. Thank you.